This is a video of how to trouble check your transmission codes on a Humvee. They are pretty simple, just need a little bit of work. On the passenger rear seat is a computer control box. And inside that box, you have a little basic trans computer. Put the covers, and that's your basic little GM style 4L80E computer. To get your codes to flash, you basically put a wire on the first two, the top two, and it will get the trans light to flash. And I've got a few documents here that from the tech manuals that give you some guidance on how to do this try and get this light to shine got a couple pages and you guys can go through it print it out and go through the steps here's one here's a second one gives you some guidance here's a page I found on the internet a little faded here's another one I found on the internet And this is a tech manual. Here's the code. Here's the page. And it gives you the steps to follow. And I've used this extensively. It's got a lot of pages. And this is the trans section. And it starts at 2-385, and it goes all the way to a 2-416. So these are all the go-no-go -go issues that you can follow to do the trans work. But now that you've got this pin, you go to your start, and what's going to happen is try and set up my light. So, what's going to happen is this trans light is going to flash the codes that, if there are any issues, any codes, it'll flash. So, it'll first flash a one light a flash a one and then a double flash which is two which is a 12 and that's just the default standard so it will flash one and then flash flash again which is a 12 and we'll do it three times so every code flashes three times it'll be a 12 12 12 and then it will flash whatever code is in there and once it's done it will flash one and then double again to 12 three times so I'm going to turn to run and it will start flashing one two that's a 12 one that's a 12 second time one 12 again, the third time. So here we go for codes. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, at 7, 1, 2, 3, 73. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 1, 2, 3, 73. 1, 2, 3, 4, Five, six, seven, one, two, three.
That's a 12. That's a 12 again. That's a 12, and we're done. So this car has a 7-3 code. And to get a 7-3 code, I go back to my little cheat sheet, and I have codes. So right here is my codes. With all the different codes and all the issues. And a 7.3 pressure control solenoid on this vehicle. And it can have multiple depending on what your issues are. Hopefully this will help you.